Hey guys, this is CG Animator, and today I'm going to show you how to model an ear in Blender. Now, I'm going to make this very easy so that anyone can follow. And I know that people often think of an ear as one of the hardest things to model, but I don't really think so. And uh, it's really, it's fairly easy to do. So anyone should be able to follow this. So let's go ahead and set up our scene here. So if, I'm going to say before I even do anything else, if you have a laptop, go ahead and go over here bring this menu down, press system and open GL and select emulate numpad because we're not going to be needing any layers and that turns the keyboard numbers into the, the view shortcuts so one is front view, three is side view, seven is top view, control one is back view, control R, I mean control three is the other side view but for now this one will be front view so let's go ahead and go to view, background image use background image and hold control and click load that way you can see the pictures that you're using and just go ahead and find your textures and your reference images now these are the two ones I'm going to be using there um, there's links in the description tab if you want to know and uh, after this tutorial series of modeling an ear I will show you how to model the head and then we'll connect the ear to the head okay so select the front view select image and if you want this image, it's in the description. So let's put blend to 0.3 so we can see it a little better. So now let's right click split areas. You right click this and select split area. And you click right here. And you go press 3 to go into side view. And you click X here. Control and hold load and just get your other image. Okay, here we go. And give it a second. okay there we go so now let's just do a little quick test let's scale this down and let's put this right here at the ear so we can okay right at the tip here so we can see if they're aligned no they're not so let's go ahead and move this down or up in this case that's perfect okay so that's what I did so now we can X that Let's go ahead and delete this. And before I even get started, let's go. I'm gonna go ahead and use the grease pencil. Use grease pencil. Draw mode. Okay. Let me add a new layer. Um. Let's see. Let's try, turn the opacity up and the thickness up. So, with ears, these are the two things you have to know. There's only two. There's two main parts. There's the. There's this here that goes all the way up around and in and then there's this part here that goes up here and then this part has a part that goes up here and there's this little part here but that's not even that important so I'm not quite sure if will be how many parts we'll be using but it should be fine so let's press space add mesh plane let's press tab to go into edit mode let's press RY90 Go ahead and scale this down. Okay, let's bring this over just you know, just so we can. Let's go ahead and let's position this at the edge here where it starts to form. We'll get the lobe later, the ear lobe. And let's just position this R to rotate and S to scale right about there. Let's position these top ones. I want to get rid of these, um, this manipulator so go ahead and go down here to this hand and it removes it okay let's go ahead and position these manually here okay so let's select these two control click position them control click just extrudes it wherever you click Let's see how much time we have got plenty of time okay so and just keep going along the ear rotating scaling when you have to okay it's fine Not quite sure though. I'm not quite sure how many parts there will be, so just bear with me. Uh, and just so you guys know, m mostly th from now on, my tutorials are mainly going to be on modeling because it's what I do best. And uh, I think I could get some pretty good modeling tutorials out there. I'll probably make eventually make a tutorial 
series on creating a whole character, clothes and all, but not texturing or anything, just modeling. Okay, so now that we have this part here, let's go ahead and select these two here. And let's just select this whole face here. Shift right clicking, press Shift D to duplicate. Let's bring this up here. Okay. Now let's extrude this. One, two. And let's just keep extruding like we were doing before. And you want to make sure that you extrude where you can make a face with this, like these two vertices line up. So I'll probably be making a face there. And don't even worry that much about the placement now because we can always fix it later. Select these two. Let's go ahead and extrude this out. Scale in. Rotate E to extrude. Rotate up and scale it down. Let's go ahead and move this up a little bit. Right about. Yeah, let's just move about there. So now let's just extrude this one more time up here. Alrighty. So let's go ahead and, and uh, start making the faces. So let me see here how I want to do this. Hmm. Um, actually, let's go ahead and just. Um, oops, let's get the three cursor out of the way. Let's go ahead and select these. Press F. And with these four here, let's go ahead and make the lobe. So go ahead and just put this here. Scale it as necessary. This here. And just go ahead and put this here. And then just scale this last one down. Alrighty, so don't forget to save. So go ahead over here file save as uh, your tutorial now what we're gonna be doing I'm just gonna take the rest of the time to explain some stuff since we don't even have all that much time anyway so what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be modeling this ear and instead of modeling the ear and then modeling the whole head and attaching it and having to model an ear over and over and over again I'm, we're just gonna once we're done we're gonna save it and then we're just going to import it to another head and we can just add that uh, the head to the ear or the ear to the head and then we'll always have an ear that we can have for any head that we make like we can use this head for other heads and we can always modify the ears to match the specific head so I think we got enough done today you know save it didn't I save it? let me see here your tutorial okay it's weird yes okay so that's enough for this tutorial I will see you in the next one and be sure to watch the next one thanks for watching bye